hello this is um these are these are commissions i'll be commissioned to make uh items for people that have lost their fur babies their, their puppy gods um this is floyd uh uh by marana and i believe he lived to about 14 years uh all handmade all all cut with a, a handsaw um we've got one for a black lab uh, he was just shy of his 18th birthday when he passed. Um, they're all a little bit different. This one is a little bit harder to read because the J drops down, but it is there. Um, another one with Pebbles, a Great Dane. And again, it's just to celebrate the pass it well not celebrate the passing but to, to celebrate the the life and times of a of a fur baby um they take an age to cut about eight nine hours ten hours to cut um bit interesting it's all solid wood all of it is solid wood uh they can be they can stand up by themselves or they can uh, they can be, I could mount a, a hanger on the back or a hole on the back so that they can hang on the wall. Um, and I've now taken, I've taken more commissions. I was asked to, I was commissioned to make these. So, yeah, it's something else people seem to be interested in. So I will just, just another, another string to the bow, as it were. Um, no two, no two will ever be the same, as you can see. They're not the same at all. Um, you've got the, you've actually got the name of the pet. Main letter is the the J for Jester, but you you also got the the pet's name in through the through the centre of it. The same there with Floyd. Large fancy F with Floyd written in the in the centre, and of course Pebbles. Again, written in the centre, but with a rather large fancy P. Um, and I've got a couple of other designs that I'm working on that are a little bit more fancy, but I'm also doing these as on, in much thinner woods that will be inlaid. Um, so something like a photograph, uh, um, a photographic frame. Um, with the name inlaid in some nice exotic woods that won't take quite so long um, but yeah I mean that's for it's just to just to keep your puppy guides your memories alive that's what it's all about I enjoy doing it We've got that's a, a clock. It will be a clock when it's finished. It's the dragon, um, and you, you see the dragons on the outside here. Chinese-ish, and uh, a Chinese type writing. I actually got this is the same as a Chinese takeaway I used to go to. <laughs> um, it is exactly the same writing. Um, but if you can, if you can think of it, if you can describe it, if you can draw it, if it can be drawn, then I can make it in wood. It might take a bit of time to get the, the pattern, the drawing to how you actually like it. And this is where I can work with people with some of the boxes. Um, if I can just pop back to this one again. I was literally asked for a box that's 26 centimetres by 26 centimetres so that a book, a photographic album of the baby can be placed into it a bit deeper, three or four centimetres deep, so that the baby first bonnet, gloves, mittens, uh, booties can be kept. And I was literally, that's the size of the box I want, knock yourself out with a design. So. 107 hours worth of my life in that and that is the design that I've come up with and Danny Absolutely loves it and she originally said she wants the baby's name across the front And she's agreed with me that it would destroy the pattern. So I'm going to put the baby's name somewhere else Yeah